Hi guys, it's Dr. Nina here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna do a very popular treatment at my clinic for everyone I would say from 35 plus, which is the Dermar filler into the marionette lines, which are those nasty lines from the mouth to the chin area. So normally um, I inject those areas in people that start to have a little bit of jowling that we notice from 35 plus. So in Katie, I'm going to do a little bit a, um, a vertical vector with the candela to soften and fill this area here that she's not happy with. So normally this will be my favorite approach at the beginning to deal with um, lower face, uh, I would say initial sagging and then obviously if we take a step further then we can explore other procedures such as PDO threads or when the left that will actually give a degree of skin tightening on the lower face but as I she clinically presents now I think I believe this will be the best treatment. I'm going to create a nice vector coming from the bottom to kind of fill and lift this area uh, and the same thing for the marionette lines or mouth to chin lines. Again, there's a ligament that runs through here, almost like blocks the, uh, the tissue. So when they start to descend, um, they create this pouch. So, okay, so what I'm gonna do now is um, injecting some derma fillers into the nose mouth lines and the marionettes. So we call it the marionette lines fillers. I will do a touch up also in the nasolabial, but the way I like to do it is just by creating a very nice lifting vector from the bottom up. So I like to do this treatment with a cannula because it allows me to have uh, even more peace of mind. So it is safer and it allows me to give a really nice lift of um, this area here. So I'm gonna be using a 22 gauge cannula, which is the largest one. The bigger cannula is, instead of being scary, it just means that it is safer in essence. And that the treatment is, um, is really not painful. So, chin up for me, thank you very much. Lovely. Okay, tiny shell scratch, well done. So with this area, it's very important to do all the marking first because when the patient lays down, obviously the anatomy of the tissues does change. So the risk of not marking is that you can actually inject where the ligament is or above and actually give bigger gel. So marking is essential. And I always like to do very small boluses, massage, and always checking them doing the right thing. As you can see, the patient is completely comfortable. So, mm -hmm. <laughs> thumbs up, which is a good sign. Lovely. Already from here, I can tell the right side is so much fuller, but without, having, without adding any heaviness. So normally in this area here, I would choose a filler which is not too thick. So the thickest one means more lift and more volume. I would go for them for cheekbones and jawline when you want a really sharp definition. But for the marionette lines, you want her to have full soft movement when she smiles and when she talks. Lovely, so I'll do a touch up in the nose and mouth just to kind of. Lovely. Okay. You okay? Mm, yeah. Thank you. 
Whenever I go for the no sumar flying fillers, I always like to keep it very, very natural because my philosophy is definitely less is more. For me, it's all about doing very subtle tweaks just to, you know, enhance someone's beauty, but not to change and not to make a natural. So it's sometimes you require multiple treatments, which means very small multiple amounts that actually will end up looking more natural than having let's say just one treatment with a lot of product so in the nose to mouth lines I always keep this triangle here without fillers because if you bring that out too much then especially on the side profile they can just give you the unnatural projection of the smile and is always a, give away that you have some treatments on whether for me my challenge with my clients and on myself as well is to have treatments where people can't really tell they might compliment you saying you look great you look fresh but they can't pinpoint exactly what happened I know, they just has lifted everything really nicely um, and it's just going to look better and better. Uh, of course! 